you know, we made plays when they were there and, you know, kept it simple when we needed to. And um, you know, I thought we played uh, overall, uh, you know, a good 200-foot game. What do you feel like is the biggest difference in how you guys have played all week this week versus, you know, that first week after the deadline? Uh, you know, everyone's wanting the puck. We're, we're playing together and um, supporting each other, and that's huge. And, you know, whether it's a five-foot pass to get out of the zone, and, um, you know, if we can get out of our zone quick and, uh, you know, try to get on offense, we're, we're, we've been, get, been good about it. Hey, Ty, what's the thought process when uh, you guys get the quick three goals, go up for two, and then they come back and tie it? They took, you know, took that shot and then came back and tie it. What's your mindset right there? Yeah, I mean, you know, I think, um, you know, they're, they're offensive uh, a team, and, you know, they're going to score goals. Um, but, um, you know, we stuck with it, uh, you know, went to a shootout and, you know, Fabs had a nice move and, you know, Burns uh, stood on his head for us again. Yeah, sticking with it, I mean, earlier in the season when an opponent <clears throat> would do something like that, you guys just kind of seemed to sag. Is that, you know, going through that process that you've come out like this, then that you know not to let it affect you guys that much? Yeah, you know, just those games, you know, you learn from them and, um, you know, we're just trying to, you know, whatever, um, 12 games left, you know, just build off of what we keep doing and, um, you know, don't let the, you know, them scoring get us down and just keep battling back and, um, you know, we have been. You guys are really tying, tying your, you know, career high in points. What does that mean to you? Yeah, obviously, that's what you, you know, you play to score goals. It's fun and get points. And you know, like I said, uh, last game, you know, to score, but, you know, get a big win, uh, you know, at home is, is big. Your line in particular today? Uh, played really good. I think uh, the chemistry is coming back. Um, I think we, we kind of saw a glimpse of uh, how we finished last year and hopefully it could, uh, could go that way till the end of the season. The, you guys didn't fold when they made it, it came back, which you did earlier in the season, it seemed like. Is that something, I mean, having learned? 100%. I mean, uh, we don't want it to be that tight at the end of the game, but uh, it happens, and uh, I think we've played a really solid ga game tonight in general, so we knew we could uh, keep pushing forward and uh, get that extra point. Was there much talk before the game and in here just about the, the trouble you've had with that team and the long losing streak? Not really. Uh, to be honest with you, I didn't know till uh, the interview after the game, so uh, obviously we know they, they beat us a couple times, but uh, never would have I thought it was 17 in a row. What about building on what you did the other night against the Blackhawks? Feels good. I mean, the energy level uh, was good tonight. Obviously, the fans were behind us. Uh, it, it just feels good to to finally get a couple together. How much do you guys pride do you guys take as a line in having a performance like this? It's huge. Um, obviously, like I said, chemistry is starting to uh, connect again, and uh, I mean, it, it just Dylan's working so hard. Bird also. Uh, I'm just trying to uh, follow those two guys, and it paid off tonight. You know, throughout the game, it was a, a good game, another close game, and uh, you know we knew they could score. So uh, when we got up two, it was a, a good cushion. But um, they're an explosive offensive team, so they uh, they responded and made for a good hockey game. And, and it was nice that uh, we stuck it out and, and got the two points in the shootout. This time last year that you guys, you Anthony and, uh, and, and Tyler, got on a roll together. Uh, are you showing that what what can happen when you develop that kind of chemistry and, and momentum? Yeah, I think it's it's it is similar timing, but um, you know I think at times this year we've we've uh, shown we we could be a good line, and um, you know we, I've talked about it before. We want to be a line that uh, is a great line when it matters, and uh, you know what it, this this hockey matters to us right now, and and we're uh, we're playing for our roles and our our jobs next year, and. Uh, plan to build towards something bigger than this year, and, and uh, uh, it feels good to you know have a game tonight where it kind of just came to us, and we didn't uh, didn't really force it a whole lot, and and uh, you know we made great plays, and and we're working to to support each other. So um, you know hopefully we can keep it going and and uh, get our confidence and, and our chemistry back together. Dylan, how it been that long since you stood in here, and after the Minnesota game, you used the word catastrophic. What what's clicked since then? Um, you know what, I think we're stuck in there. We've got great goaltending, but uh, you know we've stuck in there when things haven't gone our way. They, they scored two tonight, and, and after that, uh, to make it 4-4, and after that, we, we bottled it up, and we didn't, we didn't give up a whole lot. And, uh, you know, I think tonight it was nice. We, we scored four, and, and you know, 
uh, that helps a lot when when things don't uh, go your way. You, you have a little cushion there. So uh, we've been we've been scoring and we've been we've been playing close defense. And uh, you know I think uh, Bernie's taking care of the rest. So it's been uh, it's been uh, more of the response we're looking for when things don't go our way in, in the past couple of games here. Dylan, how important was it, regardless of what the standings are, to finally beat this team? Well, we knew, like I said, they played last night, so um, you know it's a hard back-to-back -back coming in from Boston, and uh, but uh, it is. It's we, we got them two more times uh, the rest of the year here, so uh, you know it, it'll be fun playing these guys. Those, these games matter for them, and um, you know it, it just uh, uh, we got to play like that every time. We showed emotion, we stuck together, and and. Uh, we got great goals, and I can't uh, emphasize that enough. So that that uh, that helps a lot there. Without a shadow of a doubt, there's growth in a bunch of the young guys. Um, that doesn't always manifest itself in points and those types of things. It's in it's in learning to play the right type of hockey that that ultimately is going to lead to to real success. Uh, and I think our, our young guys have had to, for the last couple of years. You know, since uh, Z retired and Pav retired and uh, Croner now retired, they, they've got to sink or swim, and it's been hard. But but that's how you learn. And and you know, part of learning is. Uh, understanding when 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 uh, things go the wrong way to, to to push back, and I thought we did a, a pretty good job of that tonight. Um, you know, they uh, they played very well. Um, uh, they get lots they get lots of opportunities, so they need to uh, play like a top line, and, and they did that. And you know, when we've had success here over the last couple of years, uh, that line's uh, been a big part of it, and they need to be a big part of it. And I, you know, I think uh, two games in a row. They've played pretty good now. Um, you know, I think there's there's still growth there, but I think they've done a good job, and I think they're going to have to the rest of the way for us to to be a good team. You know, like I thought in the first period, we were really good with the puck. We we wanted the puck. We managed the puck. We we made plays when there was opportunities to make plays. We lived another day when we had to live another day. We weren't as good at, at that as the game went along. And so, you know, sometimes that's uh, trying to make something out of nothing. Uh, sometimes it's uh, uh, not being confident with it um, and we just weren't as smooth. And, and so you don't get out of your end as much and all of a sudden you're giving them extra chances and, and uh, they're not a team you want to give extra chances to. Um, earn trust. You know, he's earned trust over uh, the last uh, number of weeks. And, and when you earn trust, you get opportunities to do that. And, uh, uh, you know, it was the – we wanted uh, Phil Horonic uh, out the next shift against Kucherov. And, and they have Point and uh, Sorelli, and, and they're good skaters. And you need a good defender. And, you know, ultimately he stalled the rush against there. That could have been uh, – it could have been real dangerous. The three-on-one, he stalled it. Um, you know, it was partially their own guy, but it was partially his good defense. He didn't give anything up. So I, I like his brain a lot. I like his compete a lot. I like his demeanor a lot. Uh, he will grow as he gets stronger and quicker. Um, those are the two areas he's going to have to grow with, but he will. I think he'll put the work in.